At a hackathon, you build something really great over the course of a weekend. And everyone has seen the amazing things that have come of hackathons. And imagine what it'd be like if you had eight weeks to spend on a project as opposed to just a weekend. In the first two weeks of the Summer Academy, you're going to learn Swift, Apple's new programming language. You're going to build and clone a few of the most popular apps out there. And then you're going to design your own app or game. You're then going to spend six weeks of the program developing your own app and shipping it on the App Store. By the end of the program, every single participant has their own game on the App Store, which is incredibly valuable to show to colleges or future employers. It is the perfect portfolio item. And it's that thing that's going to keep you excited about studying computer science, because once you have that first taste of people actually using something you've created, you're never going to want to stop. When we started developing our curriculum, we first looked at what do we look for in developers we hire. We then expanded that to look at all of our friends who are running startups, and expanded that even further to look at big companies. And we talked to recruiters and said, what do you care about your developers having? And every single company told us that they don't really care about your GPA, and they don't care about what school you went to, they care about what you're able to build. I made Push Push. It's a two-player tug-of-war. I mean, the structure of the summer program is perfect for a game like this because it was incredibly simple. You can play it in about 30 seconds. And it was also great to have people who were willing to play test it. You know, I would stand up after having just like built my game and go walk over to someone and say, hey, you two play against each other. I want to watch what you do. I think the summer academy is so much more fun than high school. You like work at your own pace, which I really like. You learn so much more practical knowledge than in school, but it's very hands-on and that's really fun. That being able to attend tech meetups, being able to go to local events. If you're from a part of the country where that's not commonplace and you've known since you were young that your passion is CS, programming, building things, you've come to your home. I had honestly never seen like that many people who were just motivated to learn all this in the same space. And we all motivated each other and every day we were responsible for like what everyone else was doing. And it was nice that you got to just be with people who were there to help you succeed. When I decided to come to the Academy, I came to finish my game. I, I wanted to see my game on the App Store. After, like towards the end of the Academy, I started realizing that the skills that I have are in high demand, you know, and I, and I realized that I do have what it takes to work for, you know, a startup, and, and it just really built my confidence. It's pretty interesting that when we get started on building your own app, uh, most of the students are, are very intimidated. They're saying, hey, I don't know enough, there's no way I can actually do this, but they learn through that process and learn how to be resourceful, teach themselves all the skills that they didn't know, and by the end of it, once they have that confidence that they can actually build and ship a product, it gives them the confidence that they can go and tackle any problem that they'll, they'll face in the future.